overview, uh, geographic and temperature setting of the diverse west, the western part of present-day United States, extending f from the top corner of Washington throughout California, most part of Nevada, Utah, Colorado, and Ohio, was the home of diverse uh, aerial Native American groups. They lived off the region's rich natural resources. They were gradually cultural places in dignity, and people in the West since the climate and the resources change intensively, creating miraculously without different groups and with uh with their advantage over a hundred thousand famine uh recognized tribes live in the modern day California. Great Great Bastine, the vast majority of land between the Rocky Mountains and the Syria Nevada was home to the Morocco something 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 I I just don't know how to pronounce the tribe names Utah and something people among others next page so this is a map that shows that where were they living there's basically nothing here for me to tell you so next page Introduced the native people. Salmon was a plentiful along the Colombian uh, uh, coral rivers. Native fishermen would have large harpoons and stab fish when they're swimming in the water. Complex system. However, natural disaster like mudslide, earthquake could potentially disrupt the salmon patterns. The great Bastine natives were first to create the canals added fishing process to be easier. This is a photo of a man with a spear that's getting salmon. Society organization, distant yet connection. Yumi. The salmon dominated the trade network as well as diets in the west. The Dalel, the islands, the upstream, the long and narrow Colombian rivers became a central point for trade and workings of the people. These tribes will often remove places, plain corn site, world currency, and world domestic diligent people, including the La. Okay, I'm just gonna say it. A C J A C H E men people of the of California live in compact and easy to build and easy to move a uh, wick up made wood leaves and bushes. Other researchers in rich area in the Pacific North, people live in villages structured as reliable as food and people in the area. Next page, the great considerate of the resources, other created religious uh, stratified uh, structure throughout the West villages. They're organized by complex society system, which men will hunt for fruit, will hunt for fish, and women have to take harvest crops and prepare meal, food, trade. The Hunkalo people who strategize the Colombian River ensured fishing hunting success practice slavery to become the labor's task for large animals this is a picture of a woman harvesting
Let me continue. Less densely to populate people in the in in the original tribe relationships. Constant evolving. People generously identify families with bands, call them tribes. Tribes would include a few hundred or thousand people, aligned to a culture, aligned to a gang, aligned to gather in small units, up to ten to twelve people. In areas spread to natural resources, groups are normic, is not connected to each other, even to the hunting task. Those Western American Indians are really, really outdated from their counterpart. What do you think of this topic?